a drizzly day, a good day to meditate. As your thoughts wander outside, they run into the rain. So you bring them back. Because what's really important is happening right here, right now, not out there someplace. You're shaping your life by your decisions. So you want to be very clear about what they are, what motivates them, what you anticipate. And to see that, the mind has to be very, very still, because there are many layers of motivation in the mind. You uncover one and realize, oh, there's stuff further down, so you can keep digging inside. So today's a good day to dig inside. The air is cool, it's refreshing. In a few days they're forecasting record heat. This is the way it is with the world. Things change really fast. And all too often our problem is when it's cool and rainy like this, you complain about the cool and the rain. Say that it's chilly. Can't do this, can't do that because of the rain. Then when the rain stops and it gets really hot, then you complain about the heat. John Fuang used to say that this is why devas are fed up with human beings. They can never, they can never please us. No matter what the weather is, there's going to be something wrong with it. So change your attitude. What's today good for? Today is good for being very quiet and inside. To dig down inside without any concerns about what's outside. Your body can be comfortable. You can wrap up in some blanket if it's a, a little cool, too cool. In other words, take advantage of the situations as they present themselves. The Buddha talks about people complaining how it's too hot, it's too cold, and this, in this way things never get done. There's always too something. For the mind is looking for an excuse. On the other hand, a mind that realizes, okay, that the time we have is precious. You've got a good cool day like this, okay, you don't have to worry about the heat. You can focus in on what's really important inside. On the days when it's hot, you can focus on training the mind so it's not complaining about the heat. And John Fung's phrase, when it's raining like this, the body may be wet, but the mind doesn't have to be wet. In fact, the mind isn't wet. In the same way when the heat comes, the mind doesn't have to be hot. Heat is an issue of the body. Cool is an issue of the body. You want to focus on issues of the mind. And this is a good day for doing that. 